Did the U.S. hack into German Chancellor Angela Merkel's cell phone? The German government says there are signs that they did. And on Wednesday, Merkel called the White House to demand answers. Press Secretary Jay Carney. All, all I can tell you is what the president told the chancellor. The United States is not monitoring and will not monitor the communications of the chancellor. Uh, you know, as we've said in the past, uh, you know, we gather foreign intelligence just like agencies, uh, similar agencies uh, of other countries. Uh, uh, but we are working to, uh, as the president has said, uh, to review the way that we gather intelligence to ensure that we properly balance both the security concerns of our citizens and allies uh, with the privacy concerns uh, that everyone shares. Carney underscored the strong bond between the two nations. In a statement about the conversation, Germany seemed to suggest it wasn't satisfied with the U.S. response. The chancellor's spokesperson added that they would see any sort of monitoring as a, quote, grave breach of trust. This isn't the first diplomatic dust-up since it was revealed that the U.S. has a vast monitoring program in place. French President Francois Hollande is calling for the U.S. monitoring program, codenamed PRISM, to be a key topic at a meeting of European leaders. And in recent months, Moscow granted asylum to Edward Snowden, the former U.S. contractor who revealed PRISM's existence.